So welcome to this first process in which we are going to tap into your secret source. In essence, this is how you help your ideal clients get from where they are to where they want to be. And we do this by drilling deep into your own before and after story. You see, your ideal clients are always you from a previous point in your life. So the situation may be very different, but the essence of the struggle is the same. And if you think about it, you endured the struggle, you navigated your own way out, you found the path. And so now your best place to help your ideal clients navigate that struggle through the quickest, shortest and easiest route possible. So this is where we begin the journey. So if you haven't already printed off your workbook, then please just hit pause on this video and go ahead and do that. And we'll go through the questions very quickly together first of all. So I'm just going to guide you through. The first question is, how do you want your people to feel as a result of working with you? So I don't want you to think about, you know, what have I helped other people feel or what have past clients felt? I want you to tune internally for you. What is What comes up as an answer from deep within you? How do you want people to feel as a result of going through your coaching? What do you want them to experience as a shift in mindset and a shift in emotional state? The second question is, what do you want people to be able to do as a result of working with you? So it could be you want, you want to help them be able to grow their business, to help them be, have the courage to speak up for themselves, to set boundaries and say no, to be able to find true love, to become a published author, uh, to become an accomplished speaker to feel empowered to take more risks. So they're just lots of different examples, but really dig into what do you want people to be able to do as a result of working with you. Okay, so the third exercise is a statement that you're going to complete. And the statement is, helping people get these kind of results is so important to me because and then you fill in the blank from the perspective of the pain and frustration of not getting these results. So what are the, how bad does it feel to live in the struggle when they're not living the results that you help them get? And really go into it, you know, really lay on thick the pain of, of not living in the way you, you want to help them live. The fourth statement, again, you're going to complete the, complete the sentence, helping people get these kind of results is so important to me because, and then you fill in the blank from the perspective of how great life is in this particular area after they get the results. So describe it from your perspective. How great does it feel now that you've got this result, you've endured and overcome the struggle, and now you're living in this particular way, having experienced this this shift in how you feel and think. The fifth question then is, what's the difference that made the difference? In other words, this is the solution. So by way of quick example, in my case, I can really go to town and describe from my perspective, in my experience, the crippling fear of visibility. The sleepless nights in my business, worrying about money, worrying about where the next client is coming from, feeling the shame, the overwhelm, the insecurity. I can also describe on the other side how great it feels to be running a business, doing what I love, working with amazing clients, feeling clear minded, confident and aligned. And then for question five, when I go into well, what was the difference that made the difference? Like what was the turning point for me? Well, it was when I truly nailed my niche and I aligned my business with my passion. So that's by way of example, my example, to help you um, get some clarity on how to complete those, those questions. So I hope you enjoyed this first process. I think, honestly, it's such a beautiful process to dial into your own before and after story and really drill into what was it that made the difference? This is the key solution. 
you know, it could be a mindset shift, it could be an awakening, so to speak, it could be a practical change you made. So go ahead now, complete the task in the workbook, complete the questions. And before you go, if you are up for a challenge task, here it is. The challenge task for this process is to craft a Facebook post with what you've un uncovered using this process. And Create a, a post that you're going to put into the Coaches Business Academy group and remember to tag me so I can check it out. And the format of this challenge task or this post is going to be, there was a time when I, and then you describe the pains and frustrations that you've just described in, in statement three. Then I discovered a secret. So then you're going to insert what is the difference that made the difference? What did you discover? And then the third paragraph of the post is, and now my life looks like this, and describe specifically how your life has radically improved in this particular area. So you're using your answers to create a post, and then post that in the group with a selfie if you dare. So this is going to be really building your visibility confidence as a challenge too. So I hope you enjoy this process. Again, take your time, allow the answers to percolate, and I will see you in the next process.